Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to create a new company file in QuickBooks. So here I'm using QuickBooks Accountant 2020 version, desktop version. And let's begin. I'll click this, create a new company file. And I'm going to create the company file for myself. So I'm the admin. And I'm going to choose the detailed start so we can properly customize our company file. Okay. So the name of my company file is Laguna Testing Lab, and we do analysis for air, land, water, wastewater, etc. Actually, the other information are optional. I'll click Next. And the industry, I'll just choose the general service-based business. I'll click Next. And it's a corporation. Next. My fiscal year is January, but of course you can use you can choose your own fiscal year. Next. For the admin password, I will leave this blank for now. Next. And this is where I will save my company file. Next. So here. So it's now creating the new company file. Okay, there. I'll click next. So what do you sell? I sell services and products. Do you charge sales tax? Yes. In the Philippines, um, it is VAT. I'll click next. Do you want to create estimate in QuickBooks? I'll click yes. Uh, trick, uh, tracking customer orders in QuickBooks. I, uh, this is for this to... This is to enable the sales order, so we will not be do doing that. So I'll click no. Using statement in statements in QuickBooks, these are the statement of accounts that you will be sending to your customers. I'll click yes. Do you use progress invoicing? I'll click no here. This is usually for construction businesses who do progress invoicing or the percentage of completion kind of invoicing. I'll click next. Managing bills that you owe. This is to enable the accounts payable in QuickBooks. So we're going to click yes. Okay. Tracking inventory in QuickBooks. So I will click yes. I'll be selling inventory. Tracking time in QuickBooks. I will be, no, we will not be tracking time in QuickBooks. I'll click no. Right. Do you have employees in QuickBooks? Um, sorry, do you have employees? We do have, but we are not using QuickBooks payroll, so I'll click no. Right. And now using the accounts in QuickBooks, I'll click next. So this is the date that you will start tracking your finances in QuickBooks. So here, I'll just click the beginning of this fiscal year. I'll click next. This is... The chart of accounts, but I'm going to uncheck uh, uncheck all of this because I have my own chart of accounts, and I will upload them to QuickBooks in a separate video. Okay, I'll click next. All right, so we're done. Go to setup. Okay, so this is my company file. For more QuickBooks tutorials, tips, and tricks, just subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you!